Coming to you live from the AT&T Center in San Antonio, it's the San Antonio Spurs and the Golden State Warriors. Hi everybody, I'm Marv Albert along with Steve Kerr. Steve, as this one gets underway, what's the game plan for the Spurs? Well, their problem, Marv, is that Al Harrington is too big for the smaller players down on the block, but he's too quick for the bigger players on the perimeter. You've got to find a way to keep him on the outside and contest every shot. All right, we are underway. Bowen giving no room. Nice entry pass. Harrington with the shot. Al Harrington. Nice pass inside. Duncan firing. Tim Duncan. Here's Ellis. Jumper off the mark. Oh, what a pass. And Monte Ellis comes up short. Parker walking it up. And that's a three-second three violation. Second violation. Steve, you obviously Antonio. lost track of time. Yeah, you don't often see that call, Mark. Most post players try to get in and out of the lane quickly. They know that rule exists, and yet I think a lack of concentration there. Al Harrington. Parker moving to the front court. Here's Duncan. I like the game plan here, Marv. They're playing with a purpose. They're getting shots in spots they're comfortable in, and they're really executing offensively. What a pass. Delivery to Finley. Finley looking to make his move. Tim Duncan. How about the pass, Marv? Beautiful feed leading to the finish. Ellis with a layup opportunity. He'll have to force. Tough Tim shot there. Duncan. Somehow he gets it to go. Davis on the hop. Delivery to Harrington. And the field Al goal. Harrington. Parker in possession. Here's Duncan. That will count. Tim and the foul. Duncan. Duncan to the line. He's a 62% free throw shooter. Tim has uh, had his problems at the line, Steve. He has, but Mark, this is why the Spurs are so tough to beat in the fourth quarter. They can go down to Duncan on the block and get to the foul line, which really allows them to control tempo in the fourth quarter. Steven Jackson. And a foul is called. Looks like they're going to switch into a zone, Marv. They've been playing man-to-man -man most of the way, but this is an opportunity to try to disrupt the offensive flow. Marv, they did a terrific job getting the ball in the paint. They just didn't make the basket. And Michael Finley, give it away at home. Finley. Great job offensively, Marv, running the lanes and finding the open man in transition. And that's a big basket here in the early going. Here's Harrington. And rebounded by Bowen. Into the game. The and Brent Popovich takes a timeout. They're going to switch up from a zone to man-to-man -man here, Marv. Try to disrupt the offense. Good job clogging the lane, Marv. Not allowing anything easy at the basket. Two minutes yes, the the with a quick quarter. release. Stuffs. Steven Marv, Jackson. Offensive rebounding is about quickness and anticipation. It's a terrific play there. 
Delivery to Bowen. Bowen fires it out. And Tony Parker off the mark. Boy, we've seen him make that shot so often from that spot. That, that's one of the areas on the floor that he just loves. Even with the defense all over him, he's able to drain it. Nice entry pass. Duncan with the rejection. Here's Harrington. Al Harrington. Parker from downtown. A wide open shot and gets the friendly roll. Bruce That's Bowen. great hustle there, Marv. You've got to love the effort. The offensive putback following the rebound. Yesikevichus to the rim. Sarunis Yesikevichus. Delivery to Duncan, and Tim Duncan not able to hit. Changing defenses is an important way of disrupting the flow of the offense, Marv. They're going to go back to a man Baron here. Aaron Davis. Bowen puts the speed on, and Bruce Bowen able to Bruce hit. Bruce Bowen. This is where clock management really becomes a factor. If they handle things correctly, so they'll end up with a two-for-one. Finley got it down low. And Tim, Tim Duncan right Duncan. back. Four-second differential between the game clock and the shot clock. And Al Harrington comes up short. Harrington kicks it back out. And a foul is called. Well, you like the defensive intensity as he tries to take the charge, but he just didn't have position. Good call by the officials. Good job by Elson. Boyle with a wide open shot. Really important, Mar, for a shooter early in ball games to get a couple of shots in areas where he's comfortable from. That establishes his rhythm. That gets him going for the rest of the game. So at the end of the first quarter, the Spurs trail by one. You got to shake it. Steve, this has been a well-played first quarter. I, I think both coaches have to be played. Yeah, both teams played pretty well, Marv. Neither team was able to build much of a lead in that first quarter, but I look for the pace to pick up here in the second. Boyle able to succeed with that box out. He can make that one in his sleep, Marvin. I mean, that, that's his comfort zone, and I don't care what you do defensively. If he gets in that spot, he's going to make that nine times out of ten. Yes, the cabbages on a catch and shoot. Well, as a coach, I mean, that's what you want. You want to get players in areas where they're comfortable, and you know, guys that talented and that good, they're going to make a high percentage of those shots. Yes, Sikevichus able to pull it back. Great defensive possession there, Marv. Everybody challenging their man. Finley right back. Tim Duncan! Here's the switch. Nice pass inside. And Al Harrington off the mark. Great defense here, Marv, forcing a very difficult attempt. And puts it down. That's an 8 0 run for the Spurs. They've got it clicking on all cylinders now, Marv. They're defending, rebounding, getting out on the break, and really sharing the basketball. And Baron Davis not able to hit. And a timeout is called. The San, Antonio San Antonio now has four seven, timeouts Fabricio left. Alberto. Parker moving it across. It's picked off. Baron Davis Baron puts it Davis. down. Well, close game here early on. So this is club trying to force the issue. Get out and get some easy buckets. 
Little change in strategy here, Marv. Defense now in his own. Davis gets the pick. Here's Harrington. Al Harrington. Parker at the point. Nice entry pass. Yes. Tim Duncan. Tim Duncan so effective from the perimeter, and that's an impossible shot to block. Yeah, it is, Mark, because he releases it from so high above his head. And remember, he's got those long arms with that seven-foot frame. Looks like they're in his zone now, Mark, trying to cover up that paint area. Very poor choice there, Marv. A, a difficult attempt, and really there's enough time to create a shot for somebody else and make the defense work a little bit. And Baron Davis Baron able to flip Davis. it home. Davis trying to stay in front of him. And Tim Duncan not able to hit. Three minutes, minutes gone by go in the fourth. Spurs quarter. up by one. Yesikevich is looking for the three. They've switched up from man to zone, Mark, trying to disrupt this offense. Tim Duncan. Good job by Parker. Nice pass inside. And Al Harrington draws the foul, and he'll shoot two. Marv, I don't mind this foul at all. His free throw difficulties have been well documented. Maybe a good defensive play there. And Al Harrington with 12 points. Delivery to Duncan. The bucket. Davis gets it down low. Al Harrington. Here's Duncan. Tim Duncan. Davis takes all the way. Here's Davis. Baron Davis. Parker gets it inside. Rebound by Harrington. Looks like they're going to switch from a man-to-man -to, -man to a zone, Marv, trying to disrupt the offense. Foyle able to extend. A Donald Foyle. Marv, as we wind down this first half, this club has a two-for-one opportunity right now. They've got Michael to take advantage. Finley. Harrington finds the opening. Al Harrington. Down to a half minute remaining in the half. San Antonio down by one. Parker looks to set it up. That was a three-point attempt. Duncan able to chase it down. Good job by Davis. The Spurs clear it out. Bowen wide open for three. And on that note, the second quarter is finished. The Spurs trail by one. The Spurs in a situation now where they must come from behind. They have only themselves to blame because they're not taking care of the basketball. Now they've got to be much sharper in the second half, Marv, offensively. They've got to spread the floor, move the ball, and create better shooting opportunities. And Steven Jackson blows the layup. Finley gets space. And Michael Finley at the line, first time tonight. And he 
makes them both. Davis walks to the front court. Nice entry pass. And Al Harrington comes up short. Yes. Boy, well, you hate to give up second chance opportunities like that when you're trailing, Marv. Jackson giving no room. And Tim Duncan converts. Tim Duncan. Ellis takes to the rim. Monta well, we Ellis. saw them run the lanes, get out into the open floor, and create an easy basket, and that's critical in a close game. Parker for three, handled by Harrington. They've got to continue to rebound more because despite the fact that they're Baron losing, Davis. they're really controlling the glass. You take a look at the numbers there, and you know eventually that really wears a team down. Duncan with a layup opportunity. Tim Duncan. Here's Ellis. Monta Ellis. Parker directing traffic. Nice pass inside. Tim and Tim Duncan will put it Duncan. home. Davis looking for the open man. And he puts Monta it down. Ellis. Well, Marv, any time you're in a close game in the second half, if you can get easy points, you've got to go for it. Nice job there in transition. Oberto to the rim. Fabricio Oberto. Two minutes gone by in the quarter. San Antonio down by one. Davis walks it across. A timeout taken midway through this third quarter. San Antonio now has three timeouts left. Parker on the hop. Tim Duncan. Here's Parker. Tony Parker. Here's Ellis. Monta Ellis. Parker looks to the bench. Delivery to Bowen and scores. Bruce well, in a Bowen. tight game, offensive execution becomes even more important, Marv. And Monte Ellis not able to score. Finley on the hop in the third quarter. Here's Elson not able to hit. Davis got it down low. What an athletic maneuver to find his way to the rim. Parker looking for the opening. No I know that's chance. always a difficult call for the official, but I don't know about that one. I, I do. I mean, he clearly was out of control. He ran right into the defender. I thought it was a good call, Mark. No, you, you, you see, I don't know what you're looking at, but we've had this problem all game. and uh, All game? We've had this problem for a long years. time, ever yeah. since we started broadcasting exactly. together. You see one thing, I see Duncan. something totally different. It, it is annoying. Yeah, totally. I mean, that, that's no good. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> Here's Davis. And Tony Parker with the foul. That's his third. Well, now he's got to go to the foul line to earn the two points, Marv. So I think that was a good foul. Yes, it can be. has the come Golden on. Golden State Warriors, number 33, Sarunis Yasekevichus. And rebounded by Bowen. Shot blocked. The Spurs will Out get it back. Spurs ball. Yes, Akevages trying to stay in front of him. Here's Finley. Rebound by Harrington. Davis again. Handled by Duncan. Oh, 
Owen able to extend Bruce Bowen. Beautiful defensive move. Well, you Davis. love the way they ran their lanes, kept the floor spaced, and found the right guy. Easy two there, and we are all tied up. And the pass intercepted. Into the game. And timeout for San called Antonio, late in 15, the third quarter. Matt Bonner. So important to close quarters strongly, Marvin. This club has an opportunity for a two-for-one here. Harrington on the quick release. Al Harrington. Five-second differential between the game clock and the shot clock. No, he slides over to try Into to the take game. the charge, but he's Golden too State, late. Draws the contact, Monta but Ellis. he picks up the foul. from downtown Davis able to reach for it three quarters of this one have been played the Spurs trail by two what a terrific pace we have seen as we enter the fourth quarter both clubs hitting their shots but the question is can they tighten up at the defensive end? Well, I think that's what both coaches talked about, Marv, in the timeout. Can they make stops? Can each club start to make better rotations and closeouts? Because really, there hasn't been a whole lot of defense played here tonight. Duncan ends up with it. Well, they have dominated the glass, Marv, and yet they're losing the game. I think that will change. Generally, when you control the glass, you can wear down an opponent and eventually take over the game. Here's Ellis and Monte, Monte Ellis, Ellis with 10 points. Well, when you make such a quick outlet pass, Marv, the defense is unable to recover. I'll tell you what, that reminded me a little bit of Bill Walton in his heyday. Shades of Walton, Bill Russell. How about Wes Unsell? Sure. One-time bullet who had... A terrific outlet pass. Delivery to Jackson. Here's Harrington. Al Harrington. Nice pass. And Tim Duncan off the mark. Nice play. Stephen, we look back at that play later on. That may be the play that turn this game. Yeah, it very well might, Marv, because it's the fourth quarter, you're trailing, you're trying to get back into the ball game, and to just throw the ball around like that and commit an unforced error, that's really unforgivable. Oberto fires. Well, the defense was extremely fortunate there, Marv. You can't expect to give up wide open looks and win a close game. Ellis on a quick release from downtown. And the bucket. That's an 11-2 run for the Warriors. Marv, you have to love the 4-2 to, to this team. They were down, but they've made this great comeback by continuing to play hard defensively on the boards. They're sharing the ball. They're really clicking on all cylinders now. Bruce Bowen. Finley able to break it down. You've got to take care of the basketball in this situation. You have a lead, but you can't afford to turn it over. Harrington working down low. Boy, it's fourth quarter, Marv. You can't give up such easy hoops. Nice entry pass. And the field Tim goal. Duncan is 17 for 28 from the field. Ellis with the off-balance shot. Two and a half minutes remaining in the fourth quarter. San Antonio down by three. 
That's great defense, Mark, but that's too good. Nice touch around the hoop. Davis with a nice pass. What a pass. And Al Harrington Al is able Harrington. to score. Very difficult attempt there, Marv, but he gets the ball to go in. Parker on the hop. And Michael Finley not able to hit. And Tim Duncan could not finish. Into the game. And a timeout is called. Spurs. Golden Number State now has two timeouts left. Two minutes to go. In Ellis the gets quarter. it down low. That's 12 Al assists Harrington. from Baron Davis. Delivery to Bowen. Nice pass inside. And Tim Duncan not able to hit. Davis on the hop. Here's Ellis. You can't give up easy hoops like that, Marv. You've got to force some perimeter shots. Good job by Davis. Ellis giving no room. And Michael Fenley comes up short. Well, he's awfully comfortable from that area, Marv, and that's the kind of execution they're going to need if they're going to come back and win this game. Davis facing the double team. Shot clock down to seven. Now to three. And a 24-second shot 24 clock seconds. violation is called. It's important for this team to continue to be Into aggressive, Mark. The, the last Spurs. couple of minutes Number of a close seven, game, Fabricio got to get Alberto. something going towards the hoop. Harrington on the rebound. And Michael Finley picking up an intentional foul. Marv, the best way to get back in this game is by being aggressive defensively. And the fact that they're not in the penalty yet makes this actually a pretty good foul. Harrington at the line. Misses them both. Delivery to Bowen. Fires. Yes. Beautiful yes. rhythm on that stroke, Mark. Now you've got to go back to the other end and make a stop. You're still in this game. Davis bringing it across. Delivery to Jackson. Duncan trying to stay in front of him. A costly turnover. Very casual with the ball there, Marv. You're trying to protect the leads. The waning moments of the ball game, you've got to get better execution there. Here's Parker. I like that shot there, Marv. There, there's plenty of time. There's no need to launch long three-pointers. Get a good shot. Go down. Make a stop. You're still right in this thing. And hits both. The jumper is off the mark. So the foul is committed to stop the clock. Harrington to the line. He is three of six tonight. And Al Harrington with 33 points. An opportunity for three. Michael he hit Finley it. for three. We're down to the final seconds. The Spurs are over the foul limit. Davis at the line. by Bowen and Bruce Bowen comes up short 
There's the horn, and this one is over. The Spurs have come up short. The final score is 75 to 69. Tim Duncan is the high man with 37 points. This is Marv Albert along with Steve Kerr saying so long from the AT&T Center in San Antonio. For tonight's outstanding performance, we're proud to present the Jordan Player of the Game.